grabbed it like Sham. You know, like when they like you ever been to Sea World and they like throw a ball in the water and Shamu just dives out and catches it. Hang on, Raiden, hang on! Uh oh. Looking a little grim here. Dangle for your life! Who is driving that metal dude? Wasn't the vamp in there also? I got my eye. Yep, I got your eye. Come and get it. Oh, there's the vamp. Nothing happened to him. He just come out with a bullet hole in his forehead. Vamp, go! Ha! This is so ugly. Look at this. Oh, they didn't show it. I don't think this is the part yet, but they show Vamp just booking across water. Like he's just cruising. There we go. Uh look at that. Like Randy Moss, he's just booking. He's like a, a football player and Jesus combined. It's running on water. Why? Now he's running up walls. So he's all tired now. Metal Gear finally got his fish. That was pretty crazy. Ryden, you all right? Yeah. How about you guys? Barely managed, but we're all right. The chopper? We need some time for repairs. Oh. The president's all yours. Okay. Can I ask you something? What? Are you the snake? <sighs> they said you were dead. No, not me. There are still too many things I need to do. Snake, you're a legend, and that's why I need to ask you this. <laughs> legend. Ask him. A legend Briefs is not of boxers. Fiction. Someone tells <laughs> it, someone else remembers. Everybody passes it on. I'm here because I was assigned to this mission, not because I want to. If I could, I'd be out of here in a second. How could you come back to all this? Why keep fighting? There's something my best friend said to me once. What? We're not tools of the government or anyone else. Fighting was the only thing I was good at, but at least I always fought for what I believed in. What about, what about the DNA results from that body? That was Liquid's body. He and Snake are identical on the genetic level. Liquid? A deception, for our own protection. We stole his frozen body from some organization. Kind of a hassle, though. That's all there is to it. <sighs> yep, Planet Liquid's body. Are you two really ass an in there. NGO? Insofar as we're a non-profit organization of civilians advocating a cause, yes. The cause happens to be the eradication of Metal Gear. We work on our own, but it's a cause worth fighting for. Why would you stick your neck out for something this risky? That's the way I used to Because he ain't got shit else to do, ago, homie. That's why. I was holed up in the middle of nowhere in Alaska, drinking too much. We have a responsibility to the coming generations, to the world. What responsibility? To keep track of the mistakes we've made as a species. We need to remember, to spread the word, to fight for change. And that's what keeps me alive. You think you can change the future? Nah, I'm not as arrogant as that. What you do isn't grassroots activism. It's more like terrorism. I admit that. But our group, Philanthropy, received some information. Philanthropy. A new Metal Gear prototype was being developed here. Not and it. terrorists were planning to raid the facility. The information came from a very reliable source. So you're here to... We're here to stop all that. But I also have a personal motive. Looks like the terrorists have his sister in the big shell. We're here on our own, not under anyone's orders. 
We have our own battles. Otacon's here for someone. I'm not. This is a military mission. Jack, are you all right? Just barely. You almost gave me a heart attack. Sorry. It wasn't intentional. I know that. And I know I need I don't to stay like stronger. Rose. Say a prayer for me, Rose, so I can come back. You will make it back. I'm with you all the way, remember? That means a lot to me, you know. I'm going to save the data, okay, Jack? What if I just told you, no? But yeah, I'll save. I have to save twice, though. So that means I gotta call her ass back. Colonel, Metal Gear's already gone active. It's not too late. You can still prevent a nuclear strike by securing the president and preventing password confirmation from taking place. Get to the president. He's in the core section of Shell 2. I'm checking the satellite images. Looks like you can get to the core from the other side of Strut L. The core hasn't that? gone under yet from what we can tell. Follow the you do it? down. <laughs> He's like, why don't you do it then? The only viable strut in the outer perimeter is you the L. That attack just now doesn't make any sense. It's like they have no more use for this place. Colonel, you were monitoring the codec calls. That man was the real snake all along. Maybe. Maybe? Don't let your guard down with him. Why do you say that? Because they were never a part of the simulation. They're an unknown factor. You can take your simulation and... We're yep, say it, here. say it. We Shove it in his ass. We die. Calm down. I suggest that you do, Raiden. Even if that is Snake, that has no bearing on your mission. Colonel, you and Snake used to be on the same side. I don't understand. I read about you and Snake in In the Darkness of Shadow Moses. I don't give a damn what that piece of trash said. Do you get me? I would give you a swift ass whooping, Colonel. Okay, I gotta save again. Jack, do you need to save? No, I'm just calling you because you're pretty. Okay. I'll save over this one now. Jack, how's the mission going? Fine. Fine? Is that it? Look, I really don't feel like talking about the mission. At least with you. I want to talk about something else. Okay then. Let's talk about you. Me? Yeah, your least favorite subject. That's not... Oh yeah? Then go ahead and say something. Like what? Anything. Tell me something about yourself. I can't think of anything interesting to say. Why do you want to talk about me so badly? Because I'm curious. But why? Is it really that strange to want to know more about someone you love? No, it's not strange, but... You know, sometimes I... Oh, look, now we're talking about me, not you. Why won't you tell me anything? About what you were like as a child. What kind of things you liked to do. What kind of people your parents were. I've never heard you talk about any of that. Why? I... Don't you think it's just a little bit unusual? That I don't know anything about my own boyfriend's past? Rose, when I get back, I'll tell you everything. Is that... A promise? Yes. It's a promise. 